Hello all, this is D Swank. I am back in uh, Stellaris. As you can see, the Empire of the Eternal Wheel is starting over at the moment. Uh, most of that is because, well, the game was... N I, every time I tried to load the old Empire of the Eternal Wheel um, game, what we've grown to love, it crashed. Unfortunately. So, what we're going to be doing is, let's take a look at what we could, yeah, uh, what the Empire of the Eternal Wheel is going to have, let me go back to traits, uh, we've changed out a lot of things, we got rid of one of the more broken ones for Blood of Immortality. Elemental Manipulator, Resilient and Sedentary, and the Riftwalker, uh, Advanced Military. Uh, Ring World is no longer an option, because I got rid of that mod. So we're going to go with a continental world. New uh, Sangdala. And what this is going to be is the Empire at its point in technology had advanced far enough along that they sent out a colonization fleet to uh, a neighboring galaxy and when they arrived the uh, the they had lost most of what was or what made them them so uh, divine imperium we need author authoritarian Authoritarian. Okay, but, uh, authoritarian and spiritualistic. Okay, so now we can select these. Then we've got these that we can spend points on. Ship cost, robot resource output. Uh, let's. Which one of these do we want? Expansionist. Uh, we're we're going to go with isolationist. Uh, is that what we want, or do we want... Yeah, no, let's go with interstellar travel. That fits with what we're doing. Uh, Empire of the Eternal Wheel, same thing. But, uh, yeah, we're, we're going to be... have been sent off, and we've lost a lot of our technology in the travel. Um... We're going with warp, because previously we had side drives, and this is fairly close to the side drive. Uh, and we're going to... Do we want to uh, change our ship type, or do we want to stick with... We'll, we'll stick with what we have, the mammalian ships. So... Yeah, we can replace it. And done. Wait, I have... What? Really? Oh, wait. That's traits. Because, yeah, we're, do we're done. Because I can't use them. 
All right, now, because of reasons, we're going to actually say this is a fairly small galaxy. Um, we're only going to have a handful of empires, and half of them are going to have an advanced start. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and start this. This way we can go ahead and play around and do this, uh, continue the story of the Empire of the Eternal Wheel up until the uh, new, uh, mo uh, new DLC comes out. So, that's eh, not huge. So we can, we can do this. Or, it's not a new galaxy, it's a nearby star cluster. How's that? That sounds more appropriate uh, uh, yes yes let's do that so we can go ahead hit play and we can actually speed time up at this point so let's grab you and have you explorate. All right. Okay, time to Schimmel's world. That makes me think there's going to be a, a species there, but we'll find out. But we're, uh, we don't have our legacy or anything like that, so we're, uh, we're starting all over. And, okay, so we have NSC, which is our, the modded ships. And we have the non-modded there, so... Um, well, for now, we'll just close out all that. And let's take a look at our planet surface. Oh, it's fairly small, actually. Okay, and we don't have the funds to do anything. So, now... I do have some mods on this. I have the new ship classes uh, 2.5, which is one of the mods that um, caused the crash issues. Um, I believe. I've also installed the ISB, which is for the people that requested a. Uh, excuse me. A new ship. Um, or a new a mod with titans in it uh, we have titans that we can build eventually um, also with a galaxy this size I should be able to continue and do decades like I did previously System survey complete. so good on that uh, you okay yeah that means we can only build mining station construction complete all right and we're gonna send you to these systems behind since we're kind of on the edge of the galaxy all right let's clear that clear that and we can't clear that so we need to sit here for a bit interesting yay the empire has discovered alien life and there we go I wasn't hearing any volume now I do oh what 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 I thought you were going to retreat 
smooth. Okay. Uh, research. I really thought that ship was going to retreat. Like all my others usually do. Hmm. Oh well. Uh, we can clear that one. And we can, or will be able to clear that one soon. Now, let's click this. We don't have any modules that we can build with. Um... Alright. Those are getting researched. We'll have that researched soon. I guess what we need to do, then, is build a replacement science ship. And then surface will have this cleared. All right. There we go. Special project complete. Situation okay, space complete. amoeba. Yay. Construction complete. Uh, yeah, those that those we're not going to bother with habitable world survey. And what we do need, we do need to recruit a new leader, scientist. Uh, research, new worlds. Uh, new. Okay, research speed, survey speed. Yeah, you. I have no idea how you'd say your name, but... Uh, we're going to grab you, then send you here. And then to Gujizm next. Construction complete. Uh, yay, one of our governors leveled up. Alright, um, we're going to build you okay oh and she li she's going to live 10,000 years yay um can we just kill you and get your your daughter because she is awesome All right. So, let's see, I guess up here we'll want to build a governor's mansion as soon as possible. Which is going to take a bit. Oh, you can survey. Skypton. Construction. What's, what's here? Okay. Uh, construction ship complete. Uh, okay. Research. We've got a few months to go on that. Oh, you know. System survey complete. Okay, yay. System survey. Uh, something that I probably should uh, say is in my previous... Uh, video, the one with uh, uh, the Perizno mod in Mountain Blade Warband. I uh, I started to mention, or started to say something about my uh, uh, my new image, uh, my new screen image, uh, and unfortunately, I got distracted and never actually finished the statement. Um, the new uh, new image that I'm using for uh, my icon 
on uh, uh, hydroponics farm. Do we want to do that? Yeah, we do. But what I was, um, yay, research. But um, the image that it is, it's a very stylized fox. Why I picked that is uh, back several years ago when I was still involved with the BSA, uh, they had an adult leader training um, that I Systems went to. Complete. And really, that the training, it's called Wood Badge, and for the most part, that, um, that training did a lot for me. I actually know, or didn't really learn that much new in, uh, my college classes because it was all things that we covered in, uh, the Wood Badge course. Um... Which speaks a lot about college education, that four years of college education and several, um, several hundred, well, several thousand dollars, um, and, uh, it has the same level of information that a, uh, uh, two-week... A uh, couple hundred dollar course by the Boy Scouts. It, it says a lot about um, college. Or uh, the education system. Uh, not necessarily college, but... System survey complete. Okay. Actually, let's move you here. We'll build a power plant there. Alright. System surveyed. Alright, grab you. Let's have you survey this system. But, uh, yeah, I learned... I mean, I didn't learn a huge amount with, um, my, uh, my college class because of Wood Badge. But in Wood Badge, one of the things they do is they divide the participants up into a, uh, into patrols. And, uh, they do leadership exercises, basically to help you become a better leader. That's the point of the exercises. And to teach you things like, um, instead of dictating and saying, you go do this, it's, um, it's how to delegate instead of dictate, is a way of phrasing it. But, um, the, uh, there were some very interesting elements in that that uh, helped me out quite a bit. But uh, back to the image, what we did was our patrol gained a, um, or everybody's patrol was supposed to develop a totem, which was a, uh, well, an image that is kind of a signature. It is yours. And... I designed the one that our patrol ended up using, which that is my totem that is the uh, the image. Uh, but what how it, uh, how ours worked was we had the base uh, fox head because we were the fox patrol, and since I was the youngest and also the last one to put a feature on the fox. Um, I, uh, I ended up putting on a, the collar on the neck Resume of the fox. Complete. 
um, we had a member who was a professor and he liked to teach so, or he liked to teach that's what he did was he was a teacher so um, his uh, well, that's actually not a bad initial design we can do that and that and eventually we'll be able to replace those but save that let's build a couple warhammers uh, da, 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 da. oh we need to upgrade our research complete that was good but uh, anyway uh, rambling uh, military academy naval capacity colony development speed that seems like a good idea but uh, yeah our uh, horror the whole concept uh, or other elements of the uh, image, I guess, of the the oh nice another world. Um, the whole uh, um, design aspect, we uh, the guy that talked. There we go. Let's get back on track. Um, he he talked a lot, and what he his uh, aspect was a uh, uh, was a mouth. He had one person that he was very observant. So he instead of having the slit for the eye or just the line for the eye, he had a full open eye. Uh, one person was is uh, a veteran. Uh, was a veteran. I believe, and his his uh, piece, the back of the neck line that formed the back of the neck, extended out much further, and um, because he he had a backbone, that was his big thing. So uh, yeah, that that's kind of how our uh, the patrol totem went together, and each one had a new feature in different areas so when you stack them on top of each other it became a a full image of the entire patrol which was fun I liked it um, and so I'm using my totem as my uh, uh, my image so yay for that ranty exposition on image That went way too long. The system survey complete. All right, let's send you up here. Okay, and we'll have surveyed most of the area around us. We'll need to colonize Col Colthium. Alright. Are you going to survey? Yes, you are. Okay, good. Okay. Well, now. Looks like the base has been built, and we'll have a colony ship ready to go. Uh, deep Space Science Lab, that'll be done. Research complete. Uh, research speed increase. Or blue laser research speed increase overall I think that's gonna help us uh, space bullet all right let's build a couple of those so our fleet has a little bit of a backbone and we'll take the obligation here Uh, obligation. Anomaly found. Go research it. And we're going to colonize this planet. 
Oh, that's a nice and big one. What's this? High gravity. Habitability, happiness, energy credits. Okay. I'm going to put you right there. Uh, up is down. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Oh, uh, we have a full green here. What are you? Another continental world. You, you might be worth it. But Coltium is definitely worth it. It's a much better one to colonize. Research complete. Uh, new research, ion thrusters, uh, defense platform, engineering facility. Alright, and let's hope we might have a colonizable world. It's a barren world, poo. System survey complete. Yeah. Doesn't look like you have a way of col of letting me colonize. Construction complete. Uh, survey system. Great day for the Empire. We've colonized our first system. Well, our second system since moving to this sector of space. Okay. Alright. You have been fully surveyed. Calm down. Alright. Oh, so I have the money now, the energy credits, to do things. But we're at a severe happiness issue right here. So what I really need is to have that go up. Uh, okay, yes. I forgot about that. We're, we're going to have a trader fleet going around trading. That was another mod that people had requested. Was a fleet, the, the trading fleet mod. Alright, let's take you and have you collect from there. Probably didn't need to do that. Interesting. Research. Alright, what is it? New research. Do it. Research it. Where is yellow? I don't see yellow. Hmm, gone. Alright. Research complete. New research. Research speed, yay. Um, survey speed increase. Situation log updated. All right. Uh, oh, can't research that. All right. And we're building this, which is yay. We've got a civilian trade fleet System going. Complete. Yay. Now the question is, is the reason we can't do that research because the ship moved on? Special project complete. All right. Okay, the space whales research project. All right. Can close that. 
grab you. Send you down here to build another mining station. Uh, we need a research complete. Special project complete. Ah. Highly advanced brain parasite. Okay, that's fun. Well. Uh, you know, let, let's let's recruit you a governor. Don't want that. Uh, welfare. That's good. Uh, yeah, that's good. That's a good one. Go, Yuri. All right. Uh, surface. They are really unhappy. Uh, Batharian power plant. Ah, army damage increase. That'll be nice. Uh, da -da -da -da. just a little while longer. Just a few more months, and then we can start doing other things. Let's survey that system. Alright. We're going to build here the governor's mansion. Well, it'll, I'll be able to queue it before the end of the decade. That'll be nice. It's going to increase happiness. Just something we really need. Because I have pretty much no happiness here. Mostly because our great and wondrous leader kind of sucks. Uh. Okay. And research. Oh, okay. We've already gone into the next decade. So, we're uh, we're moving on up. Uh, what do we have here that we can actually build? We can build a customs office, which we might do. Go ahead and take care of that. We've got a trade fleet going, which is nice. Um, Falmar, we might... I need to take a look at the surface of this to even know if I'm going to consider it. I don't think so. There's not much here of use at the moment. Oh, I skipped a planet or a system right back there but uh, yes the new empire is doing its thing and uh, yeah this is going to be an interesting short little game I'm sorry that the other one um, crashed and burned but uh, yeah I hope you enjoy this or will enjoy this new series that I'm hoping to be done by the uh, uh, time the new patch comes out and DLC. I have, as you can see, it's a much smaller galaxy, so I should be able to continue to go through this relatively quickly. And, uh, yeah. So, I will see you next time. Until then, bye bye